Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can easily set up your website using Wix. In previous videos uh, we talked about how to create your e-commerce website, how to start with uh, the product that you want to sell uh, on your website and uh, it led us into this point where we have to set up shipping and delivery. Don't worry, all we need to do is log in back to our Wix uh, workspace and uh, in this case we are working on a website uh, that is meant to sell skis to the whole world. So we are here in our, in our uh, workspace and what we have to do is pay attention to the left sidebar of our Wix and jump into settings. We are at uh, settings, it's second to last option on the left sidebar. And uh, first of all, we have to click on accept payments. This is something that is actually really, really crucial. And uh, here we will decide how we can uh, accept the payments for our, uh, for our, skis but if you are lending or selling something digital also you will be able to accept payments for your digital for digital goods at the moment we have three types of uh, options here first one is stripe which is the most or widely used um let's say option for accepting credit and debit cards. We have PayPal. I don't have to talk further about the PayPal and manual payments. If you want to add manual payments, this is actually the fastest one that uh, we can uh, we can add. So manual payment, it can be cash offline or cash on delivery. Cash on delivery, you will use mainly when uh, you'll be handing those uh, those keys in our 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 case is cash and delivery so I'm really <laughs> or, or when you are using like DHL or GLS or any type of delivery company and you'll get COD option then cash payments Obviously, if someone comes to your shop and yada yada yada, and then you can easily easily connect it. So, just like that. Let's go back. Uh, PayPal is one of uh, the easiest ones as well. All you have to do is enter your email address that uh, will connect to your PayPal account. I don't really want to write down my PayPal email address here. Hope uh, you are. Hope you are on board with that. And as you can see, PayPal fees are from 2.9% plus 35 cents per transactions. So this is really, I would say, expensive. So PayPal is taking uh, at least 3% of uh, all the shipment. If you are selling something that is really valuable, like skis for 500 uh, euros, those 3% can make up some money. And uh, last is Stripe. I strongly recommend you these options. Click on connect to sign your Stripe account. Once it's signed, your Stripe account will be connected to your Wix account. And uh, can you, uh, can't you find your credentials or one connected contact Stripe? And if you don't have account, just click here and you can easily get started with, uh, with, with Stripe. I strongly recommend you, it's only 1.4% for credit and debit cards. Those are the Stripe's fees, plus 25 cents per transaction. Obviously, you don't have to connect any of those if uh, you are planning on uh, using manual payments. Also, we have more payment options. Those payment options are here for you if uh, you really need to uh, accept, for example, Bitcoin as a payment method, then 
you can uh, you can use uh, Skrill Digital Wallet, for example, or POS, uh, PaySaf cards, and uh, see more more options. Brain Tree, Sum Up, and as you can see, there's 2.5 percent uh, per transactions, phone payments. All you uh, really uh, have to consider is how much you want to actually pay as a fee. In here, next option we have to sign up to make this work is shipping fulfillment. Wix will automatically sense where are you from. I'm from Slovakia. So domestic option is free shipping. We can enable it or disable it and we can edit it. So it's eight uh, regions, Banska Bystrica, basically all the regions that we have here. If you don't want to, if you want to exclude one of the regions by any, any reason, for example, Košice is the furthest one, for example, for me. So I don't really want to send it for free. We can exclude it from the, from the rest. Then so, uh, show uh, shipping or how it's uh, calculated and we can rate it by price. We can create the group, go with skis. Okay, it will be this one and uh, the default rate will be 10 euros. Apply group rate, okay, local delivery and save. can go with standard shipping okay and just save it and as you can see uh, shipping is rate by product and that product are the skis so you will pay 10 euros for shipping same goes with international you can edit it save and continue okay aye 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 uh, we can enable it or disable it. Let's discard the changes. Okay, the rest of the world. We can also add the destinations. Let's go with flat, or, uh, flat rate here. With standard shipping. And it will be uh, deliver time. Okay, 30 days and rate will be also 30 euros. We just save it. And just like that, we are, we set it up or we set up a domestic shipping rate and also shipping rate for the rest of the world. Obviously 30 euros is really not that much. So, yep. Uh, we need to, uh, you need to really take into consideration if you are from Europe, if it's worth for you to actually send skis to Africa okay so still those are two two big spots I strongly recommend using stripe as a payment method as creating an account here and creating account there and actually using uh, the visa mastercard American Express or whatever you are up to then obviously PayPal but PayPal is really expensive and obviously manual payments if someone wants to come to your shop and just have an option to buy it from you on the spot so that's about it guys if you have any types of questions please leave them underneath this video and yeah see you and thanks for watching have a great day and goodbye